This is how the king of Brazil, Neymar Jr., lives his life. From private jets, crazy whips, my boy Neymar does not mess around. Neymar got some crazy toys, but wait till you hear about the most expensive toys. And no, it's not his 4.5 million dollar Lamborghini. Stick around for his craziest purchase. Neymar got a 6.5 million dollar mansion in the outskirts of Paris. His insane mansion is where the magic happens. He can play football in his backyard with his dogs and his son David. With his million dollar piano and his crazy cars in the garage, his mansion is insane. But what if I told you, it wasn't football that made him able to afford this crib. In fact, it was poker. Yeah, you heard that right, poker. Neymar got a side hustle that makes him millions. Neymar can usually be seen on his days off, sat at the high stakes poker table, running the show. This side hustle pays the bills alone for Neymar. But what if I told you, this didn't even make as much money as another side hustle he got. My boy Neymar got an NFT collection. Yeah, Neymar got an NFT collection worth over a hundred million dollars. He bought these back in 2021. During lockdown when they were popular, Neymar is always injured. I guess making money is how he spends his free time. Another way Neymar spends his free time is playing the keys. When in quarantine, Neymar expanded his incredible list of talents and decided to add a new one, playing the piano. Neymar got pretty handy at the piano, and his musical side is beautiful. I gotta say, he's good at the piano. Just check this video out. <laughs> what can't this man do, man? But you know what is beautiful? Neymar's private jet collection. When you're one of the best players to ever come out of South America, you're gonna be splashing the big bucks for the gram. And that's exactly what Neymar does when he sat cozy inside not one, but two private jets. My guy got a Cessna Citation 680 and a Phenom 100. These private jets are fully kitted out with all the best specs, heated seats, the greatest pilots in the world, and all Neymar's favorite snacks. Even his favorite breakfast. Fried eggs. The Cessna is worth around $12.5 million, with only a few in the world. He sure does know how to live at large. The Phantom 100 is worth around 3 mil, with a top speed of 864 kilometers an hour. This thing costs about 1.2k an hour to run, but that's nothing compared to Neymar's salary. I mean, when you're as busy as Neymar, traveling for all these World Cup competitions and Champions League finals, you're gonna need to get somewhere fast. I mean, his salary's so high that this is his car collection. Now, I ain't got time to go through it all because it's just insane, but this is just a little quick rundown. Ferrari 458 Italia, Maserati MC12, Aston Martin Vulcan, Audi R8 Spider. Lamborghini Veneno, Mercedes AMG GT, McLaren 570S, and a Mercedes G63. Now, when I tell you, this ain't even all of it. His insane collection adds up way more than 10 mil. From what started out as his first Ferrari when he signed his new contract at Barca, he bought the Ferrari, not knowing that this would become a car buying addiction. He's always buying new whips. His whips are worth more than most people's lives. Now, it's not just cars and jets that Neymar flexes on the gram, but the PSG star also flexes his life with his family. But the most important person to him, Bruna Biancardi. That's his girlfriend. She a baddie. In fact, him and Bruna are expecting their first child together. I'm so happy for these two. It's like Neymar finally found love. I mean, after all them years of chilling with the hottest girls, now Neymar's got to take a break and settle down. I mean, he's getting on a little bit. Now, it's not only beautiful girls that Neymar hangs around with, but he also wears beautiful watches. Neymar's been collecting this watch collection since he's been earning the big dough with Barcelona and PSG. He got nine watches. They're worth over a million dollars, and the average watch price is 120k. You name it, 
Rolex GMT2, Rolex Daytona, Richard Milley Torbillion, Rolex Yachtmaster, Rolex Skydweller, he's got them all, that's just to name a few. For Neymar, he's conquering it all, he's played in the Champions League, the World Cup, even the Liga, but sometimes that ain't enough for him. Occasionally, he'll take part in a little classic five-a-side tournament, or even six-a-side. He'll play against normal people and completely steal the show. He's done this previous times, and he loves doing it, man. Look at the crowd. They go wild when Neymar turns up, because they know he's the best. I mean, he's the Samba King, the GOAT of small football. He's so technical, we love him. Something that most people don't really know about Neymar is the fact that he became a dad at 19. Now, we all see Neymar as some boy from Brazil, immature, doing stupid things all the time. But really, he became a dad at 19. And this forced him to grow up and turn into a man, look after his child, and make sure he has the best life that he can have. Now, I really respect Neymar for this, man, because Look at how good of a man that his son's becoming. Now, a lot of people judge Neymar on his tattoos and his crazy hairstyles, but I think he's a really cool guy. Being the son of one of the greatest football players to ever do it, you'd think, man, I want to be just like my dad and play football for the biggest clubs and play in Champions Leagues and World Cups. But what Neymar's son's done is so much different. Neymar once said in an interview, he doesn't like football. He prefers to watch Dragon and Dinosaur series. Neymar ain't too bothered about this though, because he's his own man. His son can do whatever he likes as long as he does. Now, Neymar loves to watch films with his son, and he doesn't have a home cinema like you'd think, but he goes to the cinema with his son and his family and treats them. They watch action movies and comedies. Now that Neymar is always flexing with his gold chains and his diamond rings. But one time, Neymar used to work at McDonald's. And that was only in 2010. Humble beginnings, man. Neymar always has a desire to give back to the community. I know that Neymar is an icon, giving back to the community and stuff. But even icons like Neymar need icons themselves. Now, in his spare time, Neymar likes to watch clips of Lionel Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo. He says that Messi is his idol. He even met him when he was playing at Santos. Messi must have said some encouraging words to him, man. He even described Cristiano Ronaldo as a monster. Huh, Ronaldo is a monster. You know who else is a monster? Kylian Mbappe. Now, if you want to find out about how Kylian Mbappe chooses to live his life, click on this video. It's great. Now, if you haven't clicked on the video, please subscribe. Thanks. See ya!